Also developing this Tuesday morning, a brutal attack over the weekend in D.C.'s H Street neighborhood. A Senate staffer randomly stabbed while walking down the sidewalk in broad daylight. Fox 5's Marine Umay live at D.C. Police Headquarters with details. Mo? Good morning. The suspect is in custody. That is the good news. Uh, but why this person randomly stabbed someone, that is yet not known. Police continue to investigate that aspect. But we are learning that the suspect had just been released from prison the day before he carried out this random attack. Again, this attack happening on Saturday. Let's show you some video of where it happened. As you said, it was along the 8th Street corridor. Court documents say that Philip Todd, who works in the office of Senator Rand Paul, was walking with a friend on 8th Street around 13th Street. This was around 5.20 p.m. on Saturday when the suspect, 42-year-old Glenn Neal, jumped out from behind a wall, knocked him to the ground, and then stabbed him multiple times, including in the head. The friend pushed Neal off the victim, and they both were able to run away. Court documents say surveillance footage shows the suspect just casually getting up and then walking in the opposite direction. Police found a knife at the scene, and they also saw blood on the ground. Todd was taken to the hospital, was conscious and speaking, but had life-threatening injuries requiring surgery. Now, people who live in the area obviously very shocked by by what happened. A woman who lives near H Street but didn't want her face shown had this to say. I live about three or four blocks away. I'm in the middle of a war zone and I try to not be desensitized. I try to stay sensitive. I'm so tired of hearing these kinds of stories. Also, we just got to do better as a city as far as gradually getting people the help and the service that they need. So again, a motive not known in this case of the suspect in custody, as I said, charged with assault with intent to kill. We understand that he will be in court next on Thursday for preliminary hearing. Back to you. Thanks so much, Maureen. We're back.